This is your A-Pass update for June 16th. We've got five updates for you this week. Number one, on June 7th, APAS Vice President Scott Owens did an excellent interview with Real Ag Radio to talk about the recent request APAS made to the federal government asking for a livestock tax deferral, as well as other ways that the federal government can help support livestock producers that have been hard hit by the drought, especially on the west side of the province. You can watch that video by clicking on the link in the video description below. Number two, Canada's Farm Show is being held in Regina on June 21st to 23rd, and APAS members can get tickets for free. Just scan the QR code through the link in the video description below and enter the code APAS2022 at checkout for your free tickets. Number three, every year APAS offers its Youth Leadership and Mentorship Program to young agricultural producers between the ages of 18 and 40. The program supports young Saskatchewan producers by giving them opportunities for learning, mentorship and networking in the areas of agricultural policy and advocacy. We're proud to have Farm Credit Canada as this year's sponsor, so program information and the application form are available through the link in the video description below. Number four, just an early reminder that APAS will have a booth at Ag in Motion in Langham from July 19th to the 21st. Quite a few of you will probably be stopping by the event, so make sure to come visit us at the booth while you're there. And number five, if you've got an RM Council meeting coming up and you'd like APAS update materials or if you'd like an APAS staff member or director to come to the meeting with you, let me know and we'll get it set up. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next week.